everyone. We're going to do a little adjusting workshop today. we got a great patient, a good friend of mine here, Mr. Ellis. Mr. Ellis, how old are you? Uh, 87. 87. And still kicking. <laughs> uh, Mr. Ellis spent a lot of time on a submarine in his younger days. And some of that faithful military service has resulted in this forward posture that we see kind of hunched over. Okay, so uh, Mr. Ellis has a little trouble getting up and down off the table, so when he comes in we do everything seated. All right, I've already cheated a little bit and found out what we're going to be working on today, so we'll go ahead and just get right to it. Uh, the first one we're going to do is kind of mid lumbar, about L3, and we're just going to do a seated lumbar adjustment. So you remember this one, Mr. Ellis? Yes. Sit up nice and straight for me. I'm just going to bring a little tension. We'll pull those shoulders around and just <clears throat> give it a little push. So you got to take what you got <laughs> and, and don't try to get more than is there. Right. So obviously with this type of posture we have a lot of stress here. Uh, cervical thoracic junction. So we always mobilize that and then we do a little bit of work in the mid cervicals uh, because he tells me he wants me to. So we're going to do a seated, uh, this would be a T1 push. Lean back against me Mr. Ellis. Good. So I'm just going to try to bring him to tension. Just relax. Good. So, surprisingly, we get a lot of motion when we do this type of work. And his body knows where it wants to be, so it doesn't argue with me too much. Okay, We're also going to do an atlas. Obviously a really important one for us. So this is a atlas left. Just relax, deep breath. Good. And then finally, we're going to do a C5 spinous right. Okay, nice and easy. Let me do the work, Mr. Ellis. Good. Okay. Good. For whom? Oh, you're sitting up straight. That looks great. Oh, boy. So as you can see, uh, always options when it comes to adjusting. Uh, we've been working on Mr. Ellis for quite a while now, and he's done really well. So, you know, when you see someone come in and they present with unique challenges, just think of it as a way to mix it up and keep your adjusting fresh. So I hope this was helpful, guys, and we will see you next time. Thank you, sir. Okay. Diesel boats forever. Boop, boop. <laughs> All right.